saw a great need with young people all across the country wanting to break into the field of sports agency. You go to business school, you go to law school, you go to sports management, they do a very good job of teaching you the principles of those fields, but nothing practical. They're how you recruit, they're how you deal with clients, they're conflicts of interest. In some cases, you'll see the general manager have final roster decision-making power. I've followed uh, Lee Steinberg probably all of my life. I think I've learned more skills in the last two days than I've learned in any classroom setting. Over the past two days, it's been phenomenal. I've learned, uh, one, how to take the initial step into the sport agency world, how to develop a comprehensive plan um, right from the start to gain credibility and ultimately develop your niche. The way Lee explains it is values are first and once you establish that you can establish anything and you can get your athlete to anywhere where they need to go. All this information such as the negotiation tips, how to brand your athlete, how to like create a foundation to where they can fall back on it uh, after the football. Lee and Chris did a great job harping on recruiting, marketing and, and promoting their players. And, and different strategies and, and methods that you can take into the everyday life of being a sports agent. You have to take advantage of every opportunity you have and any opportunity you let go, you're, you're gonna end up kicking yourself in the foot. So there's really no better time than now or when it's in your area or whenever to really take advantage of this academy and I really recommend it. Lee and I teach concepts of recruiting, building a practice, the economics of the agent industry, negotiating, marketing, branding, crisis management, community relations, setting up charitable foundations, and the understanding and use of media. Here's what we'd like to help you do. Here's how we're going to do it. So what happens with some of our students in this academy? Well, they've gone on to be dominant agents in the field. Some of them have decided that they would rather be in marketing or PR. Master these principles, you'll be successful.